welcome back. It's good to see you too. Are you nervous about your big day? That's okay, that's perfectly understandable. <laughs> I know, everyone gets cold feet, but I think you're gonna do just fine. I'm glad you decided to wear the jacket today. Yeah, it looks like we do have a few adjustments to make to it, but that's what you're here for, right? Don't worry about the wrinkles, I've got that all handled. It's just fine. We'll finish everything else at the final fitting. Today we're just doing the more important things that need to be done, and we'll save the minor details for the last good time, okay? Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm going to show you some of the tools that I'm going to be using today, all right? You'll just have a look down. The first thing you see right here is my measuring tape. I'm going to be using this quite often. I'm going to measure pretty much every aspect of your jacket and your trousers as well. I may even have to do a little bit of measuring on some parts of your shirt. That's normal. I've got some pins to hold back the areas that need alterations. I've got some different size needles that I might need to sew up some parts and just a little temporary one or two stitches. And so this is perfect for that. Of course, if I brought that, then I had to bring thread and some assorted colors. I brought a thimble to keep myself safe while doing that. <laughs> brought a seam ripper. And what this does, it has a pointed end and it'll pull out the seams in the areas where I need to let out a hem or something of that nature. I brought my fabric pencils. These are great for marking my measurements. I can also make a quick note on your jacket or your trousers and it allows me to do that without leaving a stain or anything permanent on the fabric. I brought my trusty fabric scissors. And for adjustments made to the heavier parts of the fabric, I brought clothes pins so that I can attach things like tracing paper or any notes or little things I need to attach to your jacket or the heavier parts of your coat. I know we talked about the buttons on the shirt and they, they weren't up to your standards and so I brought some other buttons that you can go through and we'll choose a button that's more fitting to your liking, okay? I brought plenty of those. We'll go through these later. I brought a lint roller. Those final touches before I let you walk out the door. Gotta have it looking nice. So, exactly. <laughs> and while we're on the subject of that, I brought the steamer with me. And the steamer's gonna really touch up those creases. We're gonna have this suit looking perfect. That way I know that it's hanging on you properly. If we've got a lot of wrinkles and uneven seams and exactly, then how are we going to get a perfect fit? So that's going to be the first step we do today, is getting you steamed up. And then finally, I brought some little knickknacks, mainly fasteners, buttons, things that we can use for your shirt your suit even, any little thing that I may have forgotten that's included in this little box. It's my little box of tricks over here. Okay, <laughs> we ready to get started now, huh? Okay, now the first thing, like I said, is I'm going to steam 
all of the creases in your pants and also in the jacket. So I'm going to get this steamer turned on. It only takes about 10 or 15 seconds to heat. Yes, it's very quick working. It works very well and I would recommend getting one for the day of your wedding too. Mm -hmm. It's great to have on hand for any last minute little wrinkles or things that you find because things like that will happen. Okay, it's looking like it's ready to use. Now, let me start on your trousers. Let me get down here. Now that those wrinkles are out of the fabric, I can really see where I need to make some adjustments here. The first thing I'm going to check, though, is the shoulders of your jacket. Mm-hmm. Let's see. We need to make sure that they fall in a clean line on both sides. You walk around here. Let's measure back here. This side first. Let's see. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now I need to see that this other side matches up, so let's see over here. Mm-hmm. I like that. That looks pretty good. Now I need to measure the shoulder to shoulder width here. I'm gonna have to get a little closer. Excuse me. Let's see. That looks perfect actually. Mm hmm Now let me see how it drapes on you. It appears to be draping alright. Does it feel comfortable? Okay, do you mind lifting your arms up for me? Lift your arms to touch my hands here. Okay, now let me check each armhole. Um, okay. Let's see. Hmm. Let me check the bottom of this one. Okay. These armholes let me know if the back is fitting properly. <laughs> it's looking like I need to measure the lower part of the back a little. I think there's a little bit of an offset on this arm. Let me come around and measure the back. One more time, let's see. Oh, uh, I do. I see where I need to let this out a bit. Okay. I'm going to go ahead, take that seam out, and make a few notes. Let's check it. Mm, okay. Let me take this one out first. Mm-hmm. Okay, I've got that one out. Let me make a note here. Okay. <laughs> Alright, if you can hold as still as you can, now I'm going to go ahead and take the seam out on the other side, okay? okay. Now I need to mark this one right here. Okay, now, I'm going to have to pin it up. I need you to hold as still as you can while I pin up both sides. I don't want to accidentally poke you with one, okay? Let's see. That's good right there. Okay, now the other side. Got you right here. There we go. You're doing great. Mm-hmm. Just hold still. Okay, I got that one done now. Great. That's good. Alright. Now, I need to check these coattails. 
make sure that they line up with your knees. Looks like they do. Okay, so the coattails are fine. Let's make sure that the bottom seams line up with your knuckles. Alright, that's next. I need you to just stand straight like you are. Put your arms right down by your side and relax. Just like that. There you go. Just let your arms hang loose. Let's check your knuckles. Let's see, that looks good. How about over here? Okay. That looks great. Mm-hmm. No problems there, I don't think. Now I want to check your collar. Let's pull your collar out of your jacket. Mm, just like that. Pull it out on both sides. Okay, is that comfortable? Are you good? Okay. Now, I need to see how much of your collar sticks out. I need at least an inch of the collar to come out above your jacket. Okay, I might need to make an adjustment here. I'm going to have to cut away some excess fabric there, it looks like, right? Just keep still. I'm going to get right here on your collar. You're doing great. Okay, now I need to get it on the other side also. Okay, right here around the back. Get back here. Okay, I had to trim up this excess. It looks good. a bit uneven over here. Let's mark that. Alright, I might trim a bit more. Right here. That's good. Okay. Alright, now I have to put a couple of pins around your collar. I don't want it to be uncomfortable, so I need you to sit really still. You're doing great so far. I'm going to pin this up right here. Good. Good, good, good. Alright, do you remember I said that I might have to sew up a little area? Mm -hmm. That's what I'm going to have to do around this collar because can see some major areas that need some help here. Now that that's pinned up. Okay. Ready? Okay. To get in here. That's good. One more stitch. Okay. Yeah. We're going to leave that there and I'll fix that permanently after you go today. It's going to look great. I can tell now we fixed the issue. So. All right, I want to look at your sleeves. Let's look down here for a second. No, your sleeves are looking a bit long. Mm, they're, they're covering your shirt sleeves a bit much. I need to see about one half inch of the cuff, and I'm not seeing that much. So another mark I need to make really quickly. And get and first let's start at your shoulder and go down to the cuff and 
Let's start on this shoulder and go down to the cuff. Yes, they are both about a half an inch too long. Let me mark that. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think I can do without pinning that one up. Mm. I think I can just make some marks and pin this one later. It's looking nice. How's it feeling? Mm -hmm. Do you feel like you have a lot of room to move around in? Does it feel snug in any places? All right. Okay, let me make a note of that right here. All right. I also need you to go ahead and sit down for me and stand back up a couple of times. And let's just see if everything feels like it's in the right place. Now you need to be careful with it because of the areas where there are pins Mm -hmm. Go ahead, sit down and back up. Okay, down and back up. Is that feeling okay? Okay, that's good. Now the next thing I'm going to check is your trousers. I need to make sure that they're sitting high on your waist. See, it looks like they are. Okay. Another thing is I need to see the seam going down straight to your center of your shoes. So I'm going to check both seams down here. Okay. Alright. Let me get on this side. That one looks good. Let's see. Okay. I don't know about that. Hmm. Let me check my notes from last time on that one. Okay. I think I need to let out the hem a little bit, just on this one leg. Alright. So let me go ahead and pin that up too. Get down here. Alright. I'm going to have to rip that seam out as well. <laughs> Good thing I brought the seam ripper out. Alright. Okay. It's looking great. Let me get around the back. Alright. Yeah, you definitely want trousers to be comfortable on your big day, so, mm -hmm. okay, pin that up right there, that's looking good, okay, mm -hmm. and they don't feel too tight sitting on your waist there, okay, that's good. It's important that they sit up high and not too low because then they tend to look baggy and slouchy. Not to mention, it'll put your pockets out of proportion and it'll just hang in all the wrong places. So you need to make sure that you've got it exactly on your waist, exactly how you need it. Alright? Okay. Let me grab this. And I'm gonna let you look while I get this last area pinned right there. Okay, don't want that to come loose there. Okay, I'm gonna let you look at some buttons, right? Mm hmm. I want you to get to choose the buttons you like. I brought quite a few to choose from. Now, we've got the jacket buttons. We need to pick a shirt button. 
I know you didn't like those because of the color. So you can pick something a lot more subtle. Something like that. Mm -hmm. Put that one to the side for you. There really are lots to choose from. Yeah, we can always go with this one. <laughs> I'm joking. So, something just simple. I was thinking of something maybe with a tiny silver accent. Mm. Exactly, or since you've got red in your wedding colors, maybe just a tiny dot of red. You like that one? Uh huh. Okay, I think we should get you a third choice. How about this off color one for the third choice? It's more of a cream color. And that kind of goes with your shirt. Okay, so now we've got three choices for you. Will that work? Okay. Well, if you decide that you'd like to choose your own buttons, then it's going to be a few days before I attach these. So you've got a few days to decide if you want to call me and let me know that you found something different. Oh, that's perfectly okay. I'll be more than happy to attach whichever ones you choose. I'm going to get this lint brush and I'm going to go ahead and start cleaning all the lint off the jacket so, mm, so that I can do my final little touch ups on you. Okay. <laughs> jacket. I think this is going to look great. We make these final little touch-ups. Now let's get this shoulder. And your trousers here. Looking good. <laughs> now. Okay, so since you're having your wedding and this is almost our final visit together, today you're going to get a complimentary shoulder massage. <laughs> I know that's very unusual with the suit fitting, right? <laughs> well, this is a very unusual tailoring business. So, just want you to get as comfortable as you can. Mm -hmm. Just sit down and relax. And I'm going to go ahead and get on this side and massage your shoulders. Okay? Now don't fall asleep. <laughs> shoulder and down the side. Little 
bit more. You've been really stressful lately. Try to just forget about your stress right now. Just let go. It's easy once you try. Get the hang of it. See over here. So you've got this side off. You're starting to fall asleep. That's okay. Let's try the other side now. Okay. Okay. It's like you're starting to relax a little bit, maybe you're starting to calm down some. You just need to remember to breathe when you start to get nervous. Start to have those anxious thoughts. Just try to relax yourself. Sometimes it's easier said than done, but
<laughs> okay. Now, looks like we're all done here. I'm going to make the final little alterations that I need to make. And I shall call you sometime next week to come in for your final fitting. I think I've gotten every measurement written and every little seam tucked in. And I'll be ready to see you soon. Okay? You try to relax. Alright. Keep yourself calm and don't stress too much about this. Okay? Okay. It was great to see you. You have a lovely day.